Okay, so today I have something special to share with you guys. Now, you probably already heard the rumors Apple is working on a redesign to iOS 19. As a matter of fact, Mark Gurman mentions that iOS 19 should be one of the biggest redesigns in over two decades to come to the iPhone. Now, most recently, John Prosser over on Front Page Tech shared with us images and video concept of what iOS 19 may actually look like. Now, one thing that caught my attention was the new design rumored to be coming to the icons on the home screen for iOS 19. Now, John Prosser mentions that the icons, although will be round, they won't be complete circles. And I'm the type of guy that likes to show things on device so that you guys can have a first look at it. So let's take a look at iOS 19's new icon. So what you're looking at here is a modified version of iOS. So take a look here. Now, at a first glance, you may not notice anything really changed here on the home screen, but if you take a closer look at some of these icons, you may notice that they're not full circles, but also not fully squared off like the current version of iOS. So I wanna compare this to iOS 18 here running on this iPhone 16 Pro Max. I want you to take a look there at the camera icon, the calendar icon, the weather, the photos, the emails, the FaceTime, take a look at those icons right there. Let me get a close look right there for you guys. So right there, take a look at some of those icons. Ever so slightly changed here. Keep in mind, Apple can't really afford to make really drastic changes to iOS all at once. That would be a disaster. A perfect example of that was the Photos app with iOS 18. And I also want you to take a look there at the dock. And I also want you to take a look there at the folders. So take a look at the folders there. So we see all the icons inside of the folder, but the folder itself is also sort of rounded off. So not complete circles, but rounded off just ever so slightly. Now, one feature that I always hear iOS users want is split screen multitasking. So two apps running at the same time. And I wanted to share with you guys this really cool concept here with a jailbreak tweak. So for example, if I have the app store open, you see there, this is a fully working app store, as you can see right here. Check out this really sweet animation from the bottom right. I can go ahead and grab it just like so, place the actual drawer at the bottom, and then we can select any other app from here and use it as a split screen. This is a pretty sweet jailbreak tweak, as you see right here. It is flowing very nicely, no hiccups, no issues. You can choose any app, you can launch it, as you can see right here, the news application. I can go ahead and launch the news app alongside the actual app store app. And you can see there, I can interact with both applications at the same time. This is something that many iOS users have been wanting for some time. I don't think it's going to happen, but fingers crossed, hopefully we'll see something like this. Now, last but not least, I want to talk about dual video recording. So front and rear facing cameras at the same time. According to John Prosser, Apple should bring this new capability to the native camera application on iPhone. Now, this is something that's not new. Apple has had this feature available for third party apps for quite some time. For example, if we jump into this road application right here, you see that I can use both cameras at the same time. It's just this feature is not currently available on the native camera application on iPhone. So you see here, we can switch the rear and front facing camera view, as you can see right there. So this is possible in iOS, just not on the native iOS camera application. So Apple is rumored to be bringing this feature to the actual camera on iPhone with iOS 19. Now, of course, none of this information is confirmed. We'll know more in regards to iOS 19 here in just a couple of months. We're approximately two months away from iOS 19 developer beta one at WWDC starting from June 9th through the 13th. So let me know if you're excited for some of these changes. What do you think about the rumored new icons coming to the iPhone and everything we talked about in today's video? Thank you for watching. Have a great day, guys, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.